Smartphones are awesome. They allow you to do all kinds of cool stuff from you know, take pictures, watch movies, send emails, and play all kinds of games. Now the problem with a smartphone is, if you're an outdoorsman, they're not built for the great outdoors. And I personally have ruined a phone beaver trapping, and this past duck season, I even put my phone in a Ziploc bag to try to keep it waterproof. But Griffin Technologies has come out with a Survivor Catalyst case that is completely waterproof and shockproof. Now when I say completely waterproof, I mean it. This thing was tested to three meters down, which is about 10 feet, and still was waterproof. Uh, it's also shockproof with a two meter drop test on it, so you don't have to worry about dropping this phone uh, in or out of the water. Uh, and the cool thing about it is it's very easy to install the phone. Uh, if you go, you know, it comes with some pamphlets uh, with the case, or you can go online. They've got a lot of great videos that show you how to make sure the case is waterproof before you put your phone into it, and it's very easy to install. Now, one thing I was pleasantly surprised with was how easy the phone was to still operate while it's in the case. Uh, your lock screen button, it's very easy to navigate through the screen. The mute button here on the side just twists. Your volume buttons are the same. And to charge the phone, it's just a little flip out there. Now there are a few things that uh, are different about a completely waterproof case versus you know another one you may have. Now the first thing is on this one, the headphone jack unscrews at the bottom. That's just to protect that port and keep it waterproof. Now depending on the width of the headphone jack that you're using, you may have to use this included adapter that screws down into the jack and just extends that out farther. Um, so just a little quirk, just and that'll just depend on you know the size of your headphone jack. Another thing I've had people say is I sound a little bit muffled um, on the phone, and that may be due just to the plastic that's covering up the phone, but you're gonna have a few things that you'll have to give up to make the phone completely waterproof. Uh, another thing is on the back, it's got a little plastic piece covering the lens, and that could get uh, scratched over time. I don't have any on it right now, but that may degrade you know, the clarity of your pictures. But then again, you know what you're gaining versus what you're giving up, I mean, you're protecting a pretty expensive investment in this completely waterproof and shockproof case. Now at the end of this video, make sure to stay tuned. We'll have a couple more product videos and also make sure to sign up uh, for the Monday morning must have email. I'll have a link to it in the description so you'll get a weekly video release from us and also make sure to subscribe to the must have outdoors YouTube channel. A slide also runs off of three C batteries and I know what you're thinking that may not last very long, but in the high setting, it'll run for 27 hours. In the low setting, it'll run for 84 hours, and it also has a strobe setting for signaling and safety purposes. Running offers this in a variety of finishes, and it also comes in a 